Now, just so you know, also, this is a... You know, this is a build we're still working on, of course, for uh, for KP2 and, M and MKXL. So, you know, if anything, the things will be changing. There may be some some, some right. legs, whatever. And one thing too we didn't mention is um, everything that's happening in the beta is not all the tweaks that have been made. To Are you trying to steal all the questions? Oh, I, have I didn't know. I didn't know. We'll get to that later. Man. Well, let's just do it now. So everything. <laughs> so I know I, I love how the community is taking apart their characters and finding yes. every yeah. little thing about them. Um, not everything you found will remain. Right. And there's stuff that you that you haven't seen yet. The build that you're playing with in the beta is three weeks old. Right. Maybe more. So there are things that are still fluid and changing. So mm -hmm. keep looking for stuff, but it could change. Yeah, it's in, it's important to know the beta is to test the net code, not the balance stuff. Right. right. But it's fun that we get why you guys have the passion. Right. So we understand, but everybody calm down. <laughs> yes. We'll see what happens in the Oh, when I read about the Kano stuff, I was the first person online trying it all. So Absolutely. I'm, yeah, I'm I just as much a fanboy as everybody else is. Yeah, if, if, if I wasn't here, I'd be playing Katana 24 hours a day on the beta. Right. I don't blame them. The, man sci the mad scientist Paulo is yep. Yep. always making yeah. something change. All right, let's, uh, let's check it out. All right, so Leatherface is, as you can imagine, a, a brawler. He sure. is uh, got really, really good range. Um, a lot, a lot of. Uh, well, I can imagine that chainsaw gives some good range. Yes, a Absolutely. lot of very basic uh, mix-ups. And um, he's he's not the fastest character in the world, but I think he definitely makes up for his range and a uh, power. Awesome. So we're in training mode right now. So we will show some Leatherface intros. Don't worry about that. And one of us will talk over them. Yeah, most likely me. So we can go over his normal attacks. Um, like I said, a lot of range. He can attack from kind of sweep distance when other characters cannot. He's got a lot of, uh, he's got a, like a long range overhead. His sweep attack is one of the longest range sweeps in the game. His down four attack is one of the fastest in the game. Even his little low pokes have a lot of range. So, you know, he's not really a finesse character, but he plays his game in a range a lot of characters don't because of his chainsaw. Right. Now, you, when you say he's not a finesse character, are you saying that because you also said that I should play him? Uh, yeah. Because I lack yeah. finesse. E easy to play and not a lot of finesse is, is code. But, Got you. But, I, I, I like those characters too, so it's fun. Right. Um, so, the ground sparks actually restands the, the opponent, right? Well, let's, let's just let's oh. go through uh, specials. Yeah, absolutely. Steve, do you have to look at the specials? Do we have it? Oh, no. What are you doing, Steve? All right. Okay, there we go. All right. All right. <laughs> yeah, so this is kind of his combo starter. If they get hit by the sparks, they get restand, and then you get your combo. Sure. It's what you'll use in, in the middle of a combo to kind of get your big damage. And then the EX version is pretty cool because he holds it, and then he goes forward. Now it has armor, mm -hmm. so they can shoot like a projectile or you can use it as a wake-up attack and you can armor through it. And then you have a couple options. You can choose to not go forward, or you can go forward really fast if you want. Now, is this is this uh, the ground sparks? Are they in every... Yeah, yeah, we're, we'll, yeah these are all the variation, uh, the, the like default... The common. All, the common, common... That's yes. the word you were looking for. Common. There it is. So that's kind of his key combo starter. Then he has this overhead slash, where he goes into this animation. It's a pretty quick move. It's an overhead, so you can mix it up with your lows. and. It's like your combo under, and the EX one is a little bit longer, and it has armor, so it's a really good wake-up attack. Yeah, he's doing a, it's doing good damage there on like what minimal attacks for the most part. Yeah, Leatherface is not a guy that's gonna do like a hundred hit combos, but he hits hard. Absolutely. So that's just a special move for eighteen percent. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, absolutely. Great. Yeah. Great. I mean, it's a chainsaw. Yeah. Right. Yeah. The <laughs> bull rush move, which is a low attack, he goes really far, and the EX one has armor, and it knocks them down. And it kind of complements the overhead move. So, you know, when you're around this range, and if you think sub is gonna go in, you can uh, use that as your armor move and knock him down. Or when Leatherface gets knocked down, he can mix up the overhead armor move or the low armor move. Sure, on wake up. On wake up, yeah. Or even just playing kind of the neutral game. All right, what else we got here? Then he has this spin move. Oh, that's, that's classic Leatherface yeah. at his finest. And the EX1 is a pop-up. Woo! Yeah. God bless that. Mm -hmm. So awesome. again, that's another move that you can use at this range that's really, really strong. Uh, you know, it's not the fastest move in the world, but you get to play your game in a range they can, so it's really good. Awesome. And uh, then he has an anti-air chainsaw move, so 
If you jump in, I'm gonna. Well, you can use it, and you can use it in combos. So, in the corner, you can use it to extend your combos if you want. And you can use it like more than once too, right? Because it's ridiculously fast. Or not. Uh, not so much anymore. No, no, no that was a Ooh, whole other phase. Yeah. Peek behind the curtain, everybody. Oh. <laughs> Secrets. And yeah, here you have his throw. It's one of my favorite throws in the game. Awesome. Yeah. And so, uh, what do we have special to the killer right, so variation? Killer is all based around Berserker stance. You do the stance, it's down back, and then attack it. He goes in the stance, he rubs it. And then you have three different moves you can do from it. He's got this rush move. Which where, is terrifying. Yeah. That's not the most, even most terrifying one. Yeah, no, we'll, we'll get there. Yeah. <laughs> so that goes almost the way, all the way across. It's pretty quick. And you can meter burn it to extend your combos. If you could meter burn it. If I meter burn it correctly, but I didn't. That's why you're no longer 16-bit. Yes. Yeah. There you go. And then you have a big combo extender. Oh my gosh. Then he also has this overhead move, which is the fastest move <laughs> on the stage. He just quickly goes crazy with it. So, you know. If what is that go, called? Um, Insane, I think. I think it actually is <laughs> just called Insane. <laughs> Awesome. And um, that'll restand them, and the meter burn one, he does a lot more damage. Oh gosh, so and much that, blood. That's the one we've been having our matches, I have trouble. Yeah. Because when he does that, you can you know meter burn it, and I'm always letting go of block early, but you get that one more Right, because you want to punish that, but then you you're blocking. Try, yeah, if you're mashing and you're trying to punish, that next one comes out and you're screwed. And he can use that, because you see, they don't fall down, so Leatherface can run up and continue to mix up. And that is probably the scariest one, and I think this one really nails kind of what it's like to fight a horror character. The unblockable. Ah! It runs across the screen, and this move is unblockable, and it does a really good chunk of damage. Yeah, that's pretty terrifying. Yeah, so you can use this in mix-ups. You can kind of go into the stands, and then they want to block your attacks because they're worried about the first two, and that's when you go into unblockable. Right. Then you get wise to that, you're going to start trying to attack them out of it, and then you go for the insane. Oh, gosh. And much. you can also meter burn this to get even a little bit more. Oh, <laughs> go it all the way. If there's not enough blood on the screen <laughs> go already. Go all the way. Awesome. And um, the going into the stance also can absorb projectiles. You can, if you shoot an ice blast. Yep. Yeah. So what? You mix it up. Of course. Leatherface. Yeah. A but. wacky Leatherface. <laughs> now, when when he's when he's doing, go to full screen if you could. Do the when you do the unblockable, he can freeze you here though, right? Yeah. He's not invincible. Yeah. So it's more like. You'll use it and you'll hope for the deer in headlights thing where the opponent is going to freak out, right. panic, try to block because they're worried about this or, one. Yeah. And like, then you it is not that, like people are going to be like, oh, they're going to be spamming that move. If you're full screen and you're going against Sub Zero and you slide, it's over. Yeah, you definitely. Yeah. Leather, Leatherface players are going to have to mix up all three. But wait, there's more. Ah, there's okay. more. Now you're wise to that and you're looking to slide, right? I'm wise to that. I'm looking to slide. Well, you can cancel it. Ah! You can cancel the one attack. Oh, well, well or you can just hit him. Yeah. yeah. You can cancel the one, and ah. you can cancel the unblockable, and nice. then you can fake him out. Okay. So all that's right. really killer stance. Uh, you know, it's all about the stance. Sure. And that's uh, that's pretty much it. Great. Yeah. Cool. I'll, I'll mess around with the, uh, playing Steve here for a moment. Absolutely. And I will look at a piece of paper. Sure. Just as you do. <laughs> Try to see what. Now, I butcher is, steal. is um. The rushdown one, it's all based on up close and personal. He his a lot of his normal attacks and his combos get replaced with these really quick hammer moves. He gets a really fast overhead. He gets this move where he punches you in the gut and um, goes into a restand. I'd like to point out one thing too. Uh, with Leatherface, each one of his variations has a different skin as yes. well. As you'll notice in the last time, he had a different um, uh, apron and a different costume in general and this face, yeah. and face and even the next variation that we show off will also have a different costume and face yeah, yeah so um, this one's all about like you know if if killer was about kind of this range this one's all about being up close he his new special moves are he gets this overhead bop a very quick jumping overhead is it is it called overhead bop in the uh, movement? it is not called that but I call it the uh, the jump bop. Jump bop. Jump bop. Okay. All right. yeah. I don't think that, if that catches on with the community, I'll the be jump happy. Bop. The jump bop. Jump the bop. one has armor and pops them up for a combo. Jump bop pop up. Yeah, that's a jump, <laughs> jump pop up. And then he gains uh, a new chainsaw move where it, EX1 knocks you down. It's like a combo ender. The EX1 no. knocks them down for a little bit longer. Sure. And he gains... Another chance on move where he grinds them. And then, personally, my favorite Leatherface move, he gains uh, the EX version of it. 
And this is just absolutely unnecessary. <laughs> And then probably the biggest thing about Butcher is he gains a command grab, which is a you know a tribute to the first movie, absolutely awesome move, and that staggers them. And then you can, can you ex that one? You can, and he knocks them down, and it has armor. And the cool thing about the Butcher command grab, it is one of the fastest command grabs in the game. Really, it's really really fast, really effective. So he's got a, a lot of really fast moves. Yes, he's got the fast lows, he's got the fast command grabs, awesome. So yeah, I think Butcher will be one. If you really want to get up close, or if it's an opponent who does well against the chainsaw moves, you can go with Butcher. What are you doing there? Oh, I'm just, I'm just trying some Sub-Zero stuff. You ever played Sub-Zero? I've like, played uh, Sub-Zero. You can slide and then do this freeze here like that. That's pretty cool. Never yeah, seen that before. That's different. I think that's neat. Yeah. I just, But I don't play a lot of Sub-Zero, so right. it might have been there all along, and I just didn't know. Who knows, right? Yeah. So that's pretty much it for that one, right? Yes. All right, great. All right. Pretty Lady. And then this is my favorite one. Um, my favorite thing that Leatherface does <clears throat> is uh, during one of his fatalities, he does. Ah, la, 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 la. <laughs> it's so good. It's so Woo! nasty. Woo! Oh, Woo! gosh. Gets me going. All right. I love his voice. So, um, yeah, Pretty Lady is. It is the opposite of Butcher. <laughs> if Butcher was all about up close and personal, Pretty Lady is the hard zoner Leatherface. Real quick, uh, stream chat update. Okay. Uh, I guess they saw something new with Unbreakable Sub Zero. Really? Yeah, they're good. They're uh, they're going crazy. Was it his costume? Must have been. Let's okay, go on. continue. Pretty lady. Anyway, so all right. Got a new. He's got a nice uh, suit, suit on. Yeah, like, he's came dressed back from to the a, nines. A creepy wedding. Uh, Sunday church. A yeah. disco. Uh, maybe all of these. A things. disco. A disco. Uh, he's no. Nah, he, nah, no. Yeah, he's not in a disco. <laughs> Look at those loafers, man. Yeah. My favorite disco. subtle detail. He's not wearing socks. Uh, yes. <laughs> I love it. So yeah, pretty lady gains a bunch of really really strong fast projectiles because. I mean, if you had a chainsaw, wouldn't you throw it? Yeah. He gets a straight one, and he can EX it, do a lot of damage. He gets a low one. Oh. Oh. And he even gets oh. an air one. Doesn't he get an air straight one, too? Yes, he does. Oh, my gosh. That's 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 good. That's yeah. good. I don't think I could throw a chainsaw. It actually, you know, a lot of people have said, Leatherface, how does he compete with these supernatural guys? It takes a lot of arm strength to throw yeah. a chainsaw like that. I believe it. Does. Yeah. So Leatherface, uh, Pretty Lady, in my opinion, becomes honestly one of the best keep out characters in the game. I actually think they're yeah. really, really strong projectiles. Oh. So it really, really complements the Chainsaw Normals to play from this range. Like the opponent has a hard time from full screen because of these, and then even when you get in here, you know he's still going to do really well. Right. Cool. Oh, oh, there we go. Uh -oh. I want to see if I can do anything with Grandmaster and that clone. I don't know. No. I don't think there's anything. No. No. How do Steve, you do it. I'm, I'm not sure. My, my old man thumbs, you know how it is. Yep, that's it. <laughs> so, yeah, just... You know, just throw that down, I guess. Whatever. All right, so, um, moving right along. What, uh, what else do we have? Well, I think we should uh, we should go through like maybe a match with. Uh, yeah, I'll, I'll play him. Yeah, go I'll ahead, play, play Steve. You and said we'll... you could beat him twice. Um, not only three. Get... He claimed three. Oh yeah, 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 three, 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 three. three. That's right. 